No, I feel good. Uh, it's been a long journey, of course, and it's uh, a political decision that uh, we in the armed forces in the Swedish Navy really uh, stands by, stand by, and um, unfortunately, it's a necessary uh, move, uh, big move in Swedish national policy. But uh, for sure, it's about the security environment in the, our part of Europe. Since I started in the Navy, 2009, uh, we have uh, we haven't been in the alliance, but we have been cooperating with all of the nations acting in the Baltic Sea region, in the Baltic Sea region that are part of the alliance. Uh, we have been using English as our working language uh, for uh, command and control when at sea, uh, and I mean the framework, the Partnership for Peace program. We have uh, so. Uh, the, the uh, preparations, from my point of, point of view, have been ongoing for uh, quite many years. Uh, and I don't think... Uh, we, we, we feel very ready and prepared for this. Det sker en större förändring och vi känner ju av det. Eh, rent praktiskt så tror jag inte att eh, vår tjänstgöring kommer att förändras väldigt mycket. Men eh, det är kul att eh, vi får vara med och se de förändringar som händer. Eh, och även för oss som kanske vill jobba vidare så kommer vi att få vara med på resan. Så det är väldigt kul. Det känns väldigt quite important to to be here uh, we are doing our uh, basic uh, basic training uh, in the uh, Swedish Marines and uh, we uh, definitely feel the impact that the NATO NATO membership uh, has on uh, uh, on us and, uh, and our duties Jag ska säga att jag är lite delad i NATO-frågan. Det finns ju både för- och nackdelar, men nackdelen är att man förlorar sin suveränitet här i landet, att man förlorar sin neutralitet. Men samtidigt är det en otrolig säkerhet och en bra allians för både handel och gemenskap. Så att... and just learning how to operate with something. I mean, they, they had plans for an embassy reception in Washington, D.C. to happen, so to say, and I'm sure that we will see TV shot. Sweden gets Article 5 of the Washington Treaty, so security guarantees and guarantees that NATO members will come and defend Swedish territory in the case of an attack. And NATO gets an ally who contributes its own military assets to the defense of other NATO allies, uh, but also the geography of this ally, which will allow the alliance to have a much more holistic take on pretty much all of Northeastern Europe, now that the entire territory of Northeastern Europe will be uh, NATO territory. Armed 
forces on drum and bugle.